My name is Ayana. Um, I've been going to Breezy since 2013. She's been getting me right. She's the only one I let get me right. Uh, when she quit, I stopped going to people in general. I can't. I can't let nobody else touch it. Uh, yeah, y'all heard the girl. <laughs> what is going on, guys? It's your girl, Easy Breezy, and I'm back with a brand new hair sponsor. Thank you so much, Queen Virgin Remy. They sent me this Water Wave 24-inch lace front wig. Modeling today, we have one of my clients coming back to be on my channel, and I used to do, like, versatile partial sew-ins on her for years. Like, I think it was maybe, like, four years? So this is her first frontal, y'all. <laughs> yeah, her very first frontal, and I'm glad I'm the one to put it on her. And I'm so happy that she's here because we always have a good conversation when we're around each other. All right, so right now I'm taking my sea breeze to cleanse off the application area. And if you guys are using alcohol at home, I strongly suggest you put the alcohol down because number one, it's not good for your kidneys, not just playing, but it dries out your skin really bad and it can make you break out in like red bumps. Like I've seen that a lot of times. And I used to think that that was the glue doing that to people, but I realized after I switched from alcohol to something a little bit more, you know, calmer and more subtle on the skin, like sea breeze, it stopped happening. So yeah, sometimes alcohol can be really harsh on the skin. So, you know, stop using that and get yourself some sea breeze. And if you need to load up on your skin tone stocking caps, head to galaxygirlhair.com. As you already know, well, not my new subscribers, we have three different skin tones. We have our beige, our medium brown, and our dark brown on the website. Okay, so this cap looks like it's pretty perfect on her. Now, sometimes, let's say you use a beige cap, right? Because the medium brown is clearly too dark for your complexion, but the beige may be too light. Sometimes with the beige, actually a lot of times, I'm not gonna lie, I have to pull out my makeup if the beige is a little bit too bright for people's skin. So I'll, you know, just keep some tan or some light brown powder, or whatever foundation you wear, just keep it on the side, just in case you have to kind of like, you know, tan it a little bit. Finna thing, yeah. Finna thing, yeah. <laughs> All right, so we waited for the glue to turn clear, and now we're going to stick the wig on. And what I'm realizing is this lace is a nice, like, brown color. Like, I don't really get a lot of laces that come with this, like, I guess, lace complexion or whatever. A lot of times, I get laces that are just, like, white. And it's like... Do y'all not know your market? <laughs> like, um, why are you sending me these white laces? And sometimes when you try to tint like laces that are like that, it still looks ashy on people's skin. So I like how this one already has a tint to it. You know, it already has that brown, you know, tan type of tint. So I don't have to do anything to it. Now, the only thing is, it's a little bit darker than her complexion. Like this is the only time this was actually a problem. <laughs> so we're gonna see, you know, it's not a problem yet, but let's see after we do the baby hair and after we style it, how it blends in her skin. Okay, so when it comes to the tangling, I mean, it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad, but you know, a lot of the wigs that I get from my channel, they're really like no tangling at all most of the time. So this one, it required a little bit more work, not gonna lie. I had to like really wet it down, really douse it in the products, and I had to comb it out like more than once throughout the install. So I'm just gonna, you know, warn you guys about that. But to combat that, you know, get your products, Get your leave-in conditioners, your detanglers, and this is stuff that I use on all wigs, not just this one. So just make sure your, you know, your products are on deck and your wig should be fine. 
And if you need a recommendation on a really good detangler slash leave-in conditioner, try Cantu. Y'all already know I recommend that brand every single time for curly hair. Cantu leave-in conditioner, those are the white jars with the orange tops. Dun, dun, dun. All right, so right now I'm cutting off the excess lace and we're gonna see if this lace color is gonna work on her complexion or not so much. All right, so the lace looks good. No complaints there. All right, so now let's get into the style. So she told me she wanted a simple side part with baby hair. So first I'm taking my tweezers and I am plucking the part so it can be just neater and more defined. All right, baby hair is done. Now I'm going to wrap her up with my black wrap and sit her under the dryer for maybe like 15 minutes. I slick want to dry the hair too because I want it to have a little bit more body, you know? I don't want it to be so, so flat, but we'll see. All right, so everything looks how it's supposed to look, but you know, sometimes with a tropical root setting foam, it can really like make the hair like stay there. <laughs> like it's a sticky type of setting foam, so it can make the hair stay in place like really good, almost too good sometimes. So I had to take my water bottle and spray the top so I could comb it out and make it look nice and soft again. So this is the final result and it came out really, really nice and natural looking. I like the lace. I mean, I love the lace. The lace matches her skin perfectly. And even though I was a little bit nervous that it was gonna be too dark, it actually was like perfect, perfect. <laughs> so I'm thinking like, do I need to go a little bit darker to make it match? I don't know, you know what I'm saying? I might have to keep that in mind. But thank you so much, Queen Virgin Remy, for sponsoring this video. If you guys want this exact unit, I'm gonna put all the information in the description below. If you are not subscribed to my channel already, make sure you go ahead and do that and turn on your notifications. See y'all later.